So Jal Kumar Sen and uh, in this video tutorial we are going to talk about blood relation. Of course uh, you know this topic in if you are preparing for gate then uh, this topic is not that much important because they I have seen only one or two questions in gate previous paper and uh, they have a question from this topic. But yes uh, the question pretty question right now in front of you this question has been asked in IVS examination actually probably they can ask you question related to this topic in the upcoming examination of gate that's why I'm sharing with you this question okay and the question asked in gate previous year I'll also share with you okay so uh, what is basically blood relation so for solving blood relation question we require two things attention and focus if you will have these two things while reading the question and solving the question then you can solve questions in blood relation quite easily you don't require my approach you require just an approach to solve the problem okay so just let me share with you what is exactly is my approach and I am sure this is going to help you okay now in this question K is brother of G so what I'm exactly going to do I'm going to make a layer okay suppose that they are saying K is the brother of G so K and J is of the same generation K and J both are in same like uh, around same uh, same generation right same relation j has only one daughter okay so it state that j has only one daughter okay that's okay j is the mother of l now j is the mother of l i mean this generation and this generation there is a gap right she is a mother and L is we don't know who is the, L is he or she now next L is sister of T so we can say that this is a female this is also female and J and L relation is daughter and mother right L is the sister of T so this L is having a person T a T is female or male we don't know B is the father of T. B is the father of T. Here, B is the father of T, right? And T is married to R. T is married to R. That means this is a boy. T is boy and R is a female. This is a male and B is also male. And K is the brother of J. K is also male so identifying male and female and the relation is most important in case of blood relation okay based on this question and this relation what i have just created this diagram you can see there by using this diagram we can solve questions quite easily right now in front of you two questions we have first question is how is J related to R you can see here R J relation they are asking now D is daughter of J right T is son of J and R is wife of T that means J and R relationship is mother-in-law so options yeah first option is the right okay if you did not get it then repeat it and watch it again i'm sure you will get it okay now next question is how is t related to k now look at this diagram t is here related to k k and j brother and sister right j is mother of t so that means k and t relation must be nephew right so here we have option that is second option 
so this is the way to solve questions of blood relation right but most important thing as i have shared with you we you require two things to solve questions right way attention and focus you should be focused on the question and then write, make a diagram if you have both these two make a diagram and then solve uh, read the question and solve it i am sure that you can maintain very good accuracy to solve the question right so this question has been asked in ibps ibps but well uh, in gate examination we have we also got a question but that was pretty simple uh, that's why this question i took from ips previous year paper previous year questions and i'm sure uh, this question is really helpful for understanding blood relation okay now we'll go for that question which question has been asked in gate previous year i'm sure you wanted to learn that question right so let's go for it here is the question yeah as you can see a question that is just right now in front of you this question is of only one and a half line right but if this question may get uh, may confused you how let me share with you in this question is it uh, as that abhishek is elder to seven that means abhishek and seven both person and abhishek is elder than seven right now seven is younger to ansul and there is a person a b and a s Savan is younger to Ansur. Okay. Now the correction, the correct one is which one is the correct one answer? Okay. Abhishek is elder to Ansur. Ansur is elder to Abhishek. Abhishek and Ansur are of same age, not of this. Now think about it. In this question, we don't have any direct relation between Abhishek and Ansur. They have relate with only Savan. From so, Savan is younger to Abhishek even and Ansul even. You can say that. But we don't know the relation between Ansul and Abhishek. Who is elder? Who is younger? Are they of same age or not? We don't know. We cannot identify exactly. Okay. So we can identify only one that Savan is younger to both of them. Based on the data, we cannot predict or we must not predict we cannot say the answer of this question i mean neither a nor b not even c the answer should be d right so these all three options are wrong options they have given now probably you understood why i have shared with you this question because that question was not that much up to the mark to understand blood relation that's why i have shared with you little bigger question to make you understand about blood relation and what you required exactly to solve problems related to blood relation so this is about blood relation and yes uh, if you have been watching my videos related to aptitude for gate examination then that's okay and uh, if you are getting help from my videos uh, definitely share with your friends and uh, yeah don't forget to subscribe my channel to get notification of new videos on your youtube uh, youtube home page right so this is all about uh, blood relation yeah one thing i would like to clear that is if you are preparing for gate examination then few topics are most important i mean from those topics in gate examination we have seen question most of the time those topics are time and work i have already shared with you couple of question time speed and distance probability probability number system if you are talking about aptitude then these four topics are most important in general in gate examination they have asked question from these topics most of the time but yes other than these uh, uh, blood relation and uh, you know other topics are also important just like you know logarithm from logarithm they have asked question also train co questions of train boat 
and all these questions they have asked till now okay so you can understand you can uh, solve few questions related to this topic to get the basic concept as well as the approach to solve the question okay so thanks for watching see you soon in my next video bye bye